In today's video, I'm going to tell you my journey of becoming an author. It promises to be interesting and educative as well. So don't go anywhere. I'll be right. hello guys welcome to my channel and thank you for joining me again in today's episode my name is happiness for those of you that are new on this channel and this is happiness vlogs and my old subscribers i'm so sorry that i've not really been keeping up i just hope you bear with, with me for now because very soon things will change for the better in today's video i want to tell you my journey of becoming an author yes my in one of my videos I told you how I started writing when I was in secondary school, but my journey of becoming an author does not really start that way because it actually ended there. I did not see any future in writing. When I went to science class, I felt is I'm done with writing. That that is all. Until when I got born again, then I started seeing writing as an evangelism tool. I used to write short stories, I used to write short stories or maybe Facebook, on Facebook during Christmas, New Year, Valentine's and the like. I would write all these short stories just to relate Jesus and love of Christ, something like that. Well, God has really blessed me with, with imagination. I can imagine things and pen it down in a way that we, people would love to read it. So. But my journey of becoming an, an author did not really start. No, it actually started this year. Yes, it started this year when I think February. Yes, February. When I was in school, my roommate she's a poet. So this year I had to do some stuff in school, my class and the like. So I had to scout with her. So that day I had her saying doing some voice note on WhatsApp was pronouncing some words and the like. I was like. Ah, what are you doing? They, she's on a particular group. They call it pen mistress. What they do is this. She said the, the group is mainly for writers. I said, add me to the group. The main purpose why I requested to be added to the group was because I'm a YouTuber. And I, then when I joined the group, I now discovered that they do a lot of activities, series of activities on the group. That was how this day I saw it. Authors so long, we want to become an author, join the group. Even without having a system, don't worry, join the group. So I joined the group. I I was writing a book, The Adventure. And that book, by God's grace, will be out on my birthday on September 38th. So that is the book I was writing at first, before Will I Ever Be Free came up. So let me give you the, this how Will I Ever Be Free came up. I was just on the group then there's this challenge we always do writing challenge they give us a picture and we write to it so I wrote to the picture in my mind I just wrote something there's somebody entered my DM at this so it's really making sense so how do you write it it's God do I just said it there. so I was just praying 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 that day just I think the middle of the night I was just praying that was how it dawned on me that Happiness, you've provided a problem, but you've not provided a solution. I was like, and it started to ring in my head that this is meant to be a book, not just a short story that you created a problem with no solution. Lord, how do I go about it, about this? And then you just don't know me that I should open a WhatsApp group and make my Facebook page active. Then I should start sharing the book there. I was like, I've not even finished writing this book. Just do it. So I just opened the WhatsApp group. I make my I make announcement that this book will be I'll start sharing it from so so this and in my mind I only wrote that episode one just that short clip. But because God has God is really involved. So I started writing it. I started typing it on my phone. Please 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 then I wrote I think I wrote like episode one to six then I started sharing it and I, I started sharing it. it. Then as I shared episode one, two, people were like, ah, oh, do more, do more, do more, do more, do more, do more, do more. So that was how I did it. I was able to finish writing the book from episode one to fifty. 
then I later compressed it and make it a whole book and the book is now available on my website now you can check i'll drop the link at the description if you've not gotten your own copy go and get it so why am i telling you this the reason i'm telling you this is because sometimes there are some things that god would have you do but it might not show you the big picture actually from the start I might not tell you everything about your life immediately because you might become overwhelmed with it. You might think I'm too, too small for what God is coming to into my hand. So you might lose focus, you might lose direction. So sometimes God will show you things about your life bit by bit, step by step. And what is expected of you is that you you don't you follow God part time. You trust in Him enough to lead you. That's the way it should be. You trust in him enough to, to to lead you and see you through life. I just thank God that I yielded to, to him when he was instructing me. And this writing of a thing is not going to end there. It's going to continue. I'm going to keep writing, 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 writing. And my book, <laughs> my books by God's grace is going to give life to people. It's going to help people who are depressed depressed is going to show people the light of god is going to show the people the, the love of god as well as it's entertaining intriguing you will also learn and find god in every of my book okay before i go there's actually something i want to tell you guys my book the adventure will be out on 30th of september Ooh, so Start saving your money to get it. It's just 300 naira. I'll be putting it out for just 300 naira. And also, because that same day is my birthday, 30th of September, I know you, my subscribers, there are a lot of things you want to ask me. There are a lot of things you want to ask me, maybe about my personal soul, my soul, my. Um, spiritual things, financial, anything about me that you feel you should know, I'll drop my email address at the description, drop your messages there, I will answer the one I can answer, and the one I cannot answer, I will not answer, just come and ask me that, what's the name of your gay grandmother, <laughs> I will not answer you, thank you very much for watching my video, don't forget to like this video, drop your comments, what do you see to this, has there been way where God has been leading you step by step? Or God has shown you the big picture of your life? Drop it under the comment section. Share this video with your friends. And I will see you in my next video.